JB and we keep you informed. I'm Michelle Jones and in the news, family devastated after businessman Kamar Barrett found dead in St. Andrew. Please remember to subscribe, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items. When 38-year-old entrepreneur Kamar Barrett failed to turn up at his daughter's school on Wednesday to pick her up, his family grew concerned. Their concerns were justified because a day later, his body was discovered he had been murdered. When his wife realized that he hadn't come home by a certain time, she called the school and realized that her daughter was still at school and the child wasn't accustomed to being at school that late. She got concerned that was not like Kamar, so she had to go pick her up. Right now we are devastated, Kamar's mother said on Friday. The Campion College and University of Technology graduate was found dead with a wound to the back of the head on Tambrin Avenue in Kingston 10. His car had been abandoned at a different location. He was a kind, loving son, father, brother and friend, disciplined, hardworking, very organized. It's really hard on all of us. It is very hard, very hard, because of the kind of person he was. We discovered that he was missing when he didn't pick up his daughter from school. I don't know when the police found his car. I can't say much because it is a police matter, his mother said. She appealed to the public to come forward with any information that can help the police to find Kamara's killers. Bart was last seen off Hagley Park Road, Bloomsbury Road on Wednesday between 9 to 11 a.m. He was driving a black on the CRV. Anyone with information can contact the Alfred Tree Police Station. He was very hardworking, very kind, very humble. Anything to take care of his child. If it is to get up and make a sandwich from four every morning, every day, he would do to take care of his family. He would. He knew the Lord. He was brought up in church, she said. He studied computer engineering at the University of Technology, but had an entrepreneurial venture in catering, his mother said. I'm a caterer. He catered too. He would teach baking classes. He was a private chef for an ambassador at one point in his life, so he was a provider. He was willing to do anything honest to take care of his family. Nothing was too small or too great for him to do for his family, his mother, who is a popular caterer, said. He was a real family man. His wife knew where he was at all times. When she got home and realized he wasn't there, she knew something was wrong. That is unusual for Kamar. He baked. He did his own drinks to cut down on sugar. That's the kind of person he was, she said. Barrett's death set off a whirlwind of activity on social media as many users wrote about his shocking death and posted RIP messages and several heart emojis. One of Mr. Barrett's friends, Dimitri Line, wrote Thursday on Twitter, it was a great and sincere soul. He didn't deserve this. I pray that our leaders can build a safer Jamaica for all of us. JBN, we keep you informed. Please remember to subscribe, like, share, leave us a comment and click the notification bell to receive our daily news items.